Hey, what is up guys? Time again, I'm showing you how to increase your FPS in Minecraft 1.19.2 and it's gonna be a, a big difference. So, you're gonna need two things to download. Open up your web browser and the first thing you want to download is Feather Client because it gives a huge FPS boost and you can add your own mods which are gonna even increase the FPS by even more. So download this, download and open it. Let's do the process and then we'll come back. Now when you launch Feather, make sure you log into your account then what you want to do is go to my website and go to FPS pack and go here to the 1.98.2 FPS boost pack. And once you're here, scroll down to the download the FPS boost, press on it, and then you're going to be here and press direct download and start download. All right. All right. So now I have the mod right, the mod pack right here. Now you want to open up the launcher, press add on mods on 1.98.2 fabric and open up the zip folder you just downloaded. Go into here. Continue, go to mods, and we want to take all of these mods and put them in here. So now, let's launch uh, Fabric to test it out. Alright, so this is how much FPS I'm getting with the mods, like 300 when I'm standing still. And let's try it out without the mod and see how much FPS we're gonna get on the Fabric client, that is. Alright, so we just load it in, in favor of the client, without any mods, and let's see how much FPS we're gonna get. So let's wait a bit for it to load. Yeah, I'd say it's loaded in now. Yeah, I would say that. So, we're getting, we are getting 120 FPS, 100 to 120 FPS, without any mods. But when we need... But when we use the mods, we got like three times the amount of FPS. This is why you should switch to Fever Client and using mods. And if I were to try this without on vanilla, and if I were to try this on a vanilla client, we would be getting even less FPS. So this is crazy. This is crazy how much FPS you can get more. Right. So I thought it would be good if I went through my settings too. So let's open it up. So video settings, I use render distance 10 and simulation distance 5. That's because of the, the server I play on has the same settings. And my graphics is on fast, clouds off, whatever is default, leaves qualities fancy, all particles, smooth lighting is on. You can see I mean it map levels 4. This is my performance settings and advanced and more calling. And this is my favorite client settings right here. So you can use um, perspective mod, which is really cool. Um, I think I also should go over a few more things you can do to increase your FPS. Now the best, now the most thing people recommend, or the most common thing people recommend is usually dedicating more RAM. I have four gigabytes. If you have more than six gigabytes, you should probably put it on max six gigabytes. If you put it on more. 6 gigabytes, um, you're gonna be getting better performance. What you also can do is running a Windows Deep Loader, and it's gonna. And if you have watched a video online sec tips, they'd increase FPS by a lot. So you should definitely do this. I also want to take notice to other videos, like this one here. They say um, using MSI mode, that won't increase FPS by a lot in Minecraft. GPU affinities won't increase FPS a lot in Minecraft. Why? Because Minecraft is a CPU dependent game. This will, um, I guess, won't increase your FPS. This won't increase your FPS unless you have like some virus or shit. Graphics drivers, it could potentially, but barely. You most likely already have new up drivers. And don't use home optimization. It's kind of trash. Well, thanks for watching. And bye.